so it's a snowy day here in Sedong. I'm in the entrance of Samjikil and I'm gonna just slowly walk up the spiral ramps and to show you how this thing works. It's snowing really hard today, so here we go. This is the entrance of the spiral staircases and there are these media centers on the right where you can take photos of yourself and email them, make postcards, send it to your mobile, so on and so forth. And they still have the Christmas and winter decorations up here. And that's the inner court. I'll, sh I'll show you that by and by. And I hope I don't shake too much. Sticker photo booths. There are a lot of um, small shops and stores and stalls that line the ramps as we go up. There's a lot of people around this, even if um, it was snowing today. I was kind of surprised actually. Okay, Korean tea brewing on the snow, which is very good for a day like this. The infamous tulips of the staircase. And here we go. And this is what the inner court looks like. They have a food stall in the middle and the snowman hanging from that structure over there. Let's go again. People taking photos. Some shops will let you take pictures and some shops won't. But um, So you have to be very careful when you try to take pictures and see if they have a no photo sign or sticker in front of the, the shop windows. I'll try to go a bit slower. And this is what the inner court looks like. Let's go back. It's a rather leisurely walk. I'm walking a bit fast because it seems like on cold days my camera batteries run out really quick when I'm um, taking video clips. So, Hey, the snowman up close. And you could hear GD Top in the background. Hey, it's Korea, it's K-pop. As you can see, this place is very popular with not only tourists but even Koreans. Um, you have dating couples, you have friends, you have families. Because there's a, really a lot to see and do. So even on a snowy day like this, it's kind of packed. Let me see if I could go past this group of people over here. Oh, and on this side you could see out to the streets of Insadong. And you could see how hard the snow is pouring down. Okay, now this this ramp is a bit slippery because the snow is drifting in through the open sides here. Let's take another look down the street. The way um, I like to go through this um, the structure is go make a turn going all around the ramp stairs, um, ramp, what do you call it, the spiral ramps once and go to the top and then go down by the stairs on the other side. It's uh, It works more efficiently that way and all I'm getting is the backside of people which is not good. Here we go. One more step up, a view of the court, and going up again.
and there's the I'm sure you, if you're aware of K um, the Hallyu, this is Lee Byung Hun modeling a hat. Oh, by the way, it's the Korea Grand Sale um, period until the end of February. It's something promoted by the Korea um, Government and Tourism Board. It's like a lot of things are on sale during this period, and foreigners, they got a lot of duty-free um, advantages. So whether it's here in Sadong or in the real busy shopping districts of Myeongdong and such, you'll find that sign everywhere and a lot of promotions re relating to it. Okay, now the snowmen are getting really snowy. What's good is I could, I could smell uh, the fragrance of the Korean teas <laughs> because there are a lot of tea shops here and because they have to be brewed for a long time, the fragrance really permeates the air. It's a really homey fragrance. Whoops. Okay, the ramp is pretty slippery. And cute accessory shops. And you can see the snow really pouring down in, inside here. I hope. Okay, pass this quickly, 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 quickly. And here is a cafe. I'm not sure what it was like um, now, but it was usually run by the company that ran the magazines, Harper's Bazaar and such. And um, they used to have a lot of full magazine covers standing around where you could stick your head in and pretend you were on the magazine cover. And this place is really pretty in the spring and summer because all the flowers are in bloom. Here it's like winter, 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 so. And then you have a lot of graffiti and wall on the arts and since 2011 is the year of the rabbit, you have, you're going to see a lot of rabbit motifs around the country. And we're outside. I'm going to put my hood on because I don't want to get snow all over me. And this is the outside. This is the topmost floor. Which you can imagine is pretty wide open right now and empty because of all the snow coming down. Hey, let's take a look down into the court. From way up here, there you go. And there's a traditional Korean food and cafe restaurant up here. It's really pleasant during the spring and summer when you sit outside under the awnings and enjoy the view. And it's a little bit less crowded up here because there are no shops and stores for people to like browse through. It's really, really cold. My hands are starting to freeze. And you can see the view of Seoul City in the background, the, the higher stuff, the higher buildings. And it's a cloudy, snowy day. Okay, and back to the ramp, and this is the, I think um, here and uh, the areas about around Hongdae are the only places where graffiti is tolerated within Korea. Okay, now I'm going down the stairs which are pretty slippery, and I hope I don't fall. And let's make a turn here, and down here, graffiti, graffiti, mostly like we were here kind of stuff what the kids do. So as you could see, we're back on the floor below. And when you take the stairs, you just, everything is linked together so you won't get lost. And there are little spots like the, this, which are great to take photographs in with the light lighting. And right now the snow is coming down backwards, so it's pretty. And this place used to have a lot of installation art here, but um, currently it's only empty and it only has a mural on the background. It's like a play on traditional Korean paintings, which I think is pretty cool. And back down, back down, back down. 
Uh, what I like about, excuse me, what I like about the place here is, um, even though people have written all over the, the signs and the maps, um, it's written in Korean, English, and um, in Japanese. So if you ask someone, you probably won't get lost. Okay, cute cell phone accessories. And going back down the stairs. And again. And if you look out here, you could see traditional style architecture for restaurants. And now we're back where we started. And um, as for the basement, the B1 floor, I'll just take photos of that and show you that there. There you go. This is what the courtyard looks like. So this is it, Samjikil in Insadong in Seoul, Korea. See you next time. Bye.